Welcome everybody to episode 15 of Let's Play Tech Technic. Sorry, I still can't get used to saying that. Um, I apologize now for my uploads being so wide apart. I, uh, I know I said I was going to upload every day, but I cannot upload every day. It's not that I can't. I just don't, uh, I don't feel like uploading, recording in a way. So what's going to happen now is I'm just going to record. Hopefully I can get into the habit of recording one a week. And if I can do that, maybe it'll be a little bit better. But on to the show. Um, as you can see, I did a little bit of work with the uh, tower. Well, very, very little. I put in a fence, a fence, uh, or no, wow, fence, uh, stairs in the center of that to make it kind of look cool. And... In my opinion, it looks pretty cool. I did it for all four of them. Still have not patched that. And I do have one little hole there, which is what I plan on doing for the rest of them. Um, so, now to show you what I've actually worked on. As you can see, that's now wood and stone brick. Stupid rat. And I have a sugarcane farm growing out here because I plan on using this today. And uh, I don't want you guys to be alarmed when you see this. I had to fix that block. Don't be alarmed when you see this, but, uh, well, yeah, grass floors, wood, uh, trim, wooden pillars going up, sandstone, sandstone ceilings with these four blocks being glowstone because I can't put, uh, lava lighting there, sadly. Oh, what's with the lag? Yep, I had to put, uh, glowstone here. And then everywhere else, there's lava lighting. I even did this room. And there's lava lighting in here. Um, I was actually having trouble with this light over here because there was no block above it. Kind of looks weird right there. I need to fix that, I think. Oh, no, that's good. Yeah, these uh, wooden blocks were actually burning. And actually, I lost everything from this block. Ooh, wow. Like this block over that way. I lost all of this. And then I have lava lighting in here as well. Still don't know what I'm going to put there. I might put a, another lava light. And then there's lava lighting going to go down the stairs as well. Um, down here I didn't do anything with it yet. yet. Uh, I actually did run out of wood. I mean I have a little bit in my inventory right now. But I put up uh, wooden borders around the four tunnels, or the two tunnels, that I plan on using. Um, you can also see that I have a crystal there. I do not plan. Uh, I do not plan on mining that up yet. What I'm planning on doing this episode, if I can climb. All right, I plan on. Starting a little bit of Thaumcraft. Now, Thaumcraft, I don't quite understand very much, so I need to try and construct this all based off of memory because I really don't feel like looking at any, any eye. So we're going to need one glass bottle, three smooth stone, which I know I have cobblestone in there, but I'd rather use... Uh, two more here because I'm going to need those. I believe this is what you do. Work. Alright. Then, what else do you need? You need gold, I believe. I hope. I think you need a piece of gold. One piece is good enough. I'll just take all of those and I'll take out my iron. Uh, as you can see, I actually have three buckets. And I also have eight diamonds. Um, Mined all those up, found a couple more pieces of tungsten, and I mined like three or four of them. Um, I need an ink sack. I don't have an ink sack, do I? And a feather. I do have a feather, okay. So there's a feather. And ink sack. Hmm. Why the hell would you find an ink sack? I have not seen 
any squids spawning around my world. So I'll have to, uh, yeah, I'm definitely going to have to go and find some squid. So I'll be right back now. All right, and we're back. Uh, so this is how you make, I believe what it's called is ooh, equasium. Equasium. I do not know how to say that word. And yes, I did look up the recipe, as you guys might have seen. Saw, seen. I don't know. Quasitum. Okay, we'll just go with it. Now, another thing we might need is water. So, potato cake. And you hit this. And you do that. Get a stack and a half of paper. I guess we could finish this all off. Go 56. Okay, so we already have two stacks of paper. And there we go. Two stacks, two and a quarter stacks of paper. Now, this, I'm just going to plop somewhere and let it work, do its magic, whatever you want to do. Um, we'll put it over here, because I don't think I'm going to need this spot for anything. And what you want to do is, as you can see here, we got uh, an area to put paper. So you take paper, put it there. And this is what's called research. Um, so we got cobblestone in here. Now, this is what happens. Uh, there's a loss per chance of 75%. So 75% chance that you're going to lose this, or these, actually. Success chance of only 3%. So there's a very low success rate to this. But if you do manage to get some sort of knowledge out of this research, it'll end up in here. And after, long, after a while of just sitting here letting this do its work, Eventually, you should get some research, and hopefully, uh, you'll get some cool stuff. Now, another thing I want to do is make bookshelves. Because bookshelves, believe it or not, are an excellent source of getting, uh, what's it called? I could just make five bookshelves, I'll put that in place of like that. Alright. Bookshelves are an excellent source of getting more uh, higher research values. Now, where's the other bookshelves that I have? I know I have a couple more. So, let's see if I can find it. There it is. Oh, and uh, I don't know if the volume's too loud for this, but. We'll just go with it. Do, 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 do. All right. Uh, so if this lag will let me work. Oh, we got a re fragment of lost knowledge. Perfect. I guess I could show you guys what that does right now. Um, and for this, we'll actually use our bookshelves. So our fragment of lost knowledge has a success, success rate of 33 and a loss rate of 80, so we're going to lose one of these 80% of the time. Nope, nothing. Alright, so we'll just take those back. And what we will do is we'll put these all back. Now, as you saw, the bookshelf brought this thing up to 33%. Two bookshelves, I think these are worth 10 each, so if you have three of them here, it's going to be 30%. Uh, pumpkins are a good source of this type of stuff, research value. Um, research value is 8, never mind. Research value 5. Research value 5. Interesting. So, after a long time of this, uh, this will eventually fill up. 
hopefully. I mean, we got one fragment there. So we'll just leave that going. And I guess the next thing we should build is, let me just check this really quick. I've been sitting here letting this thing work for weeks as I've been working on this. Okay. We're getting uh, alchemical coal and transferring it into blaze powder, and it's just a long process afterwards. And as you could actually see, I'm not using the texture pack again, because zombies with red eyes are considered smart zombies, and you get zombie brains from them, which is exactly what I need. See? Um, so I stopped using the texture pack because of it. See? No red eyes. All right. Yeah, there is a lag, I know. I know, I know been working with it this is the 15th episode so i've been working it for working we blah, 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 blah. can't speak today working with it for 15 episodes already um so i guess we could take another look at this see if it did anything yep we got another fragment of lost knowledge so let me take out this stuff and split up the bookshelves again and put the fragment of lost knowledge in there Hopefully it'll work this time. A uh, very small chance of success, so I don't. I, I doubt it'll work. So, oh, we have another try. Let it work. If this does work, honestly, this would be the first time that I've ever seen it happen. Because uh, I've worked with this on another world, but it really doesn't work very well. Um, so yeah. Melons are also a great source of research value. Uh, they come at a price, though, so... The next thing I guess we could do is make a condenser. Yeah, we'll make a condenser for that. So let me just quickly look it up how to make it. Condenser? I believe that's how you spell it. Ah, oh, stupid thing. Oh, come on. You're almost there. Come on. I'll be right back. Alright, again, I'm back. Now, to make a condenser, you need to take out all of this stuff. All of this beautiful stuff in here. And we need this. So... You open it with a pick. Never knew that. Okay. And yeah, still using that really nice mouse I have. Really gotta put crafting tables around my house, around this base. Um. All right. So you do this: four obsidian in the corners, an alchemical chest in the center, and four diamonds around that to make an energy condenser. Now what this condenser does is, if you put it... I should really move this stuff around. Move this over. Uh, oh well, we'll do that later. Alright, so you put the energy condenser there. Hold on a second. Come on, obey me. Let's say we want to make more ultra nihilus fuel. Okay, you put an en energy condenser down like this, right next to your uh, energy collector. And you take out everything. And then this piece of equipment here will begin to create energy. It'll collect energy off of the condenser, and it'll continuously make alternate fuel. So, let's see what we can make here. put it all in there. Alright, see we made one alternal or er, one yeah. I call it alternalis fuel, but it's really not. It's um Aeternalis. But oh well. So we put that in there. Ta da we just made five of those. Perfect. So now what I can do is if I take a diamond No, I lied. I need a diamond block, I believe. Crap. Okay. Um, 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to do this then. I'm gonna need a diamond. Obey me. Need a diamond, so we'll do this. All right, we'll put this in there for right now. Um, I have seven. Let's start smelting. Yes, I could use gold to make diamonds. Four gold equals one diamond, so it's a very nice, uh, nice trade. Actually, I could just EMC the gold dust instead of using my uh, furnace. Oh well. Um, we'll just let it burn, I guess. So what I want to do now is I want to just stick. I want to get rid of the altar analysis wheel that's in here, or mid analysis wheel, or whatever it's called. And you put all these gold ingots in there. And you put the diamond up there. Ta da! Made two diamonds. Put all the emeralds in there. Eight emeralds equals one diamond, which is pretty nice too. Like that. Um. I guess I could do this. I don't think I need nine. Well, these are very important, so we'll just leave the diamond in there for right now, as the uh, thingy is going. Now let me look up how to make MK to collect or mk1 collector i should say if i just type in c-o-l-l -L, see it's got to filter all of this stuff so that's why it's taking forever it actually took a couple seconds all right oh no it is an mk2 that's interesting all right to make a dark matter which is what we need here you need let's see I think it's eight and a diamond black. Yep. All right. So we need eight diamonds, nine diamonds, and then eight alternalis fuel, which is what I'll be calling it. And I never got rid of the menu. Oh, well. So we'll check on this. How many diamonds do we have again? I think it was like six, six. We need three more. So as soon as I get 12 gold, I should be at a pretty good number, maybe eight or so, hopefully. Seven, eight. If I get nine, I should be good. What's this? Collected wisdom. Don't know how to do that. All right. Oop. Wrong menu. Wrong menu. Wrong menu. I did hit done. Nine. All right. One more. These things are worth, I think, one thousand. Oh wow. It's pretty, pretty cheap, honestly. All right. Ten. Okay. Uh, yep, yeah, okay, 10. Somebody's walking down here. I'll be right back. And I'm back. Alright, um, so really quickly, you take one diamond block, you surround it with this alternalis fuel stuff to make one dark matter. Put the dark matter at the top, put the energy collector in the middle, and surround it with glowstone. And you get the Collector MK2, um, which is, I believe that stands for Mark II, which would make sense. So now what we want to do is you want to put the Collector here and Block of Glowstone above it. And, oh, wait, 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 oh, work. All right. As you see, there are now three sp uh, spaces to put stuff in so if you just fill this area up it'll just continuously go through here uh, this block here I don't know if you guys can see that because I don't normally have my mouse recording this block here uh, always like let's say you want to put a piece of glowstone in there it will let the glowstone sit there and work well it'll stop everything as soon as it reaches glowstone it won't send it through again to continue on the process so it'll stop the glowstone let's say so, yeah, let's do that. We'll just put the four of them in there. So that's working faster. Uh, and I guess, last but not least, we could check the fragments in the, quas in the quintasium. Quasitum. Sorry, I don't know how to speak. So this is almost over, and as soon as it is, we'll put our last bit of uh, bookshelves in here to see if we can get some of uh, these fragments into theories. Fragments uh, turn into theories. Theories turn into... Like the 
diplomas looking things. I don't even know what the hell they're called. I don't remember. But uh, each one is either good nor either. Blah, 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 blah. Each one is harder to get by a little bit. So as soon as those go away, which they will now. All right, I got one more try on this. At a success rate of three, this is the worst way to do it. All right, screw it. Okay, so we got two pieces of fragments, two fragments of lost knowledge. We have high success rate, well, a little bit higher than normal. So let's see what happens here. We lost one. Oh, we have one more chance. Come on. Come on. We can do it. I know we can do it. Come on. Nope. Alright. So, looks like that's uh, the end of the freaking research we could do right now. Um, I need more bookshelves, so I'll probably be expanding that farm. Um, let's see if I have anything else in here. I should have more cobblestone. I think I just passed cobblestone, actually. That's what I was looking for. But we have one, two, three stacks of cobblestone. So I'll just put stacks and stacks upon stacks of cobblestone. And yeah, it'll work. Hopefully. So stack and stack and stack in there. And it'll just sit there and work if it's a little butt off. And hopefully it'll... Uh, hopefully it'll work. Alright. So, um... I guess that's the end of the video, guys. Uh, if you have any comment, bleh, if you have any requests for me to build stuff, uh, I will get to it whenever I can. Like I've been off-screening a lot of this. When uh, I wasn't recording, I was messing around on this world. I did all of that, and I redid my base. I might change the grass still because I'm pretty sure I had mobs spawning in my house, which was really weird. But um, I still have to finish that over there. I have to finish the barn, I have to finish the big project, which I honestly don't know what to do with anymore, because my idea is not going to work. Um, I'm not going to tell you what it is, I don't remember if I already did, it's been a while since I've last recorded, and you guys should be seeing this upload today, actually, or tonight. Um, as you see, also, I did add two more solar panels, because I ran out of energy and almost almost everything I had in the bat boxes so I put up two more solar panels um, as soon as I hit eight solar panels or so or nine solar panels I forget what's what it is I think it's eight I will uh, record a little bit to show you guys what I could do with those um, but yeah uh, I'm probably not gonna record for another week or so since it's Thanksgiving uh, and so you, for the record, so you guys know when I'm recording this, it is Tuesday, November 20th. Yeah, I think it's the 20th. I don't even know what day it is, honestly. I think it's the 20th, is it? It is the 20th. Alright, so it's Tuesday, November 20th. The last time I recorded was, I think, two weeks ago. And, well, yeah, I was planning on recording this weekend, but I was busy. And, well, yeah. So, like I said, that's the end of the video. Uh, if you guys have any requests for me to build, feel free to put it in the comments uh if you guys like the video you know subscribe like comment do all that fun stuff and yeah hopefully i'll be getting to more minecraft so i hope you guys all have a very nice day